company first purchased their first pneumatic drill. The little giant was brought in one single machine, and the company did a series of experiments against some of the best hand stealers in the mine. And this drill won hands down over the hand stealers. In 1880, the mining company employed 190 men as miners underground. Two years later, after the full investment in this technology here, 90 men worked as miners underground. And those 90 men produced 50% more ore. The result here is the mine. All of their light source at the working base was flame-based. First the candles, then the sunshine lamps, which are like little teapots poked on the hard hat, and then the carbine lamps. And even after the introduction of these electric battery packs, in the mid-1940s, you'll still see in some photographs taken in, in the underground in the 1950s, some of the men are still using the carbide lamps.